Welcome back to consecutive day 808 of a diary of a Rumpreneur. Please remember that this vlog is part of the Rumpreneur Challenge, which is my fundraising mission to save the lives of children by attempting the ultimate ultra marathon. Check the link in the comments below to find out more and how you can support it. But do give this a subscribe and a share, as the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise. Thanks for your support, and let's get started. So, consecutive day 808 of the Diary of a Rumpreneur, and I am in uh, Portsmouth today, had an investor day, and I'm just going past a really cool kind of mural, which is just there, it says Victorious, and uh, there's a stage over there, so some kind of um, concert of some kind or performance is going to go ahead, and uh, I love the brand Victorious, it's obviously linked to the war and uh, what Portsmouth has been through. But um, yeah, the reason I'm, I'm running in Portsmouth today is because we've had an investor day today and um, for our social housing business. And it's um, really, really good. There was about I think 15 people that turned up, did some viewings with us to see the houses that we take on, why we take them on, and uh, met the housing provider and everything, just to legitimize what we do. Because I think, that's something that, you know, in today's world is taken for granted, and that's trust. And I think um, too many people think that people are just going to trust you because you say something. But um, I think there's a lot to be said when you pr prove things to people. And we had our videographer with us today as well, so he's getting some content for our social channels just to legitimise what we do. And um, instantly, there were people that obviously they're, it was almost as if they're minds were put at ease when they saw real houses, a real social housing provider, um, what the condition of these houses are like and what we need to do to get them rent ready. And uh, it just made so much sense to so many people, which is uh, really, really important. So um, yeah, so 15 people that came today, some of them were existing investors. And the reason they came is because they want to invest more, but they just want to legitimise things before they, they make that that jump into investing significant sums of money. Um, we also met with some of our social housing partners, so people who work with us for a commission or a fee split for bringing stocks to the table, as we've put a whole new uh, model together for those, and we've given them a roadmap of how to get to 10k a month, uh, as in £10,000 a month in a year, and worst case two years. So there's lots of people that are super excited and stoked about that, which is, uh, which is really cool. So, um, you know, I think it has to be classed as a success today. Um, pretty sure they've got some meetings on follow-up meetings now that will result in further business. And uh, as you can see, it's beautiful out there with the, the, the sea on the Portsmouth coast, which is, uh, which is beautiful. Uh, I've never run this coastline, so it's, uh, it's cool to be able to run it and uh, as I'm, <laughs> I'm racking up my number of coastlines that I've run on as of late. Super windy on the coast, as you can imagine, but hopefully my audio visual equipment is up to, up to task. Let's get down these stairs. So, so yeah, I think to summarise, uh, it's a long way to come. I had to come, it's a three hour drive to get to Portsmouth for me, but um, it was definitely worth it. And. Uh, I think there'll be a lot of business to come from it and I think it might be something that we do maybe on a bi-monthly basis because uh, the feedback was really good as well. Um, so yeah, super cool day and tomorrow I've got another big day with a, a new saucer who's going to hopefully unlock the northwest for us again. We used to do a lot of work in the northwest but since a partner we separated from who's based up there uh, left, we, we haven't really done so because we haven't had a local presence and this is somebody who wants to take on that role. So. Again, that's really exciting. Uh, we're starting to build our sourcing network now quite aggressively. And uh, we've also got investors willing to back us, which is uh, super exciting. So exciting times ahead. But anyway, that's all I'm going to say today. I've got to finish my run and then drive home. And it's already half past seven at night. So a three hour drive by the time I get back to the car, it's going to be about eight o'clock. Bear in mind, I'm going to have to stop to get some food. It's probably going to be half 11 by the time I get home. So uh, I'm trying to cram a lot in this week purely simply because I'm away again on holiday next week, which I'm really excited about. 
So anyway, that's it for me today. As always, do give this a subscribe and a share as it's a fundraiser and the more people we get in front of, the more money we raise. Thanks for your support as always. Stay positive, stay happy. I'll see you again tomorrow.